Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be decorating my next journal. So I got some stickers from All Things Lily Ann to decorate the cover of my next journal. And I'm so excited. I've been waiting to do this. I got this journal from Amazon and it is a grid journal. Finally, I have a grid journal. Here is my current journal. As you can see, it's a six ring binder. And it's a bit smaller um, than my new one. But the reason I'm opening this is because I wanted to show you guys how many pages I have left. I still have 10 pages to go, but I'm ready to set up my next journal just so it's ready to go for when I finish this. Hopefully, I will finish this super soon. So first let's do a little haul of the stickers I bought from All Things Lily Ann. This was a freebie, just a branding sticker. This is probably my favorite sticker. It says, it's grind time. Stay committed to your dreams. I actually printed out an image because she put this print on her Instagram and I actually printed it out and put it on this journal. <laughs> Then we have Funky Fresh Productivity Juice, this Tiger, and Boss Babe. Okay, time to open this thing up. For some reason, I was really drawn to this color. Even though it's a lot brighter online, but still, I'm still drawn to this color, and I'm not normally. Okay, some things are inside. Oh shoot! Look at that grid. Probably should crease this. Let's look at what this is. Private invitation. Yeah, I don't care about that. Okay, maybe I could put that in as a page. There's a name and address area. Ooh, I could use like a fun pen on this since it's black paper. Okay, so I know that I want to use this one because I don't think this would fit on the normal size that I use and who knows if I will have this size again. So definitely this one and I think the tiger goes perfectly with this. Like they're literally made for each other. And that one's my favorite. I need to pull out my other stickers. Here are my other individual stickers. I always love using these because they add a nice little sparkle to it and I think this, this notebook would look great with that sparkle. Time to put my new stickers in here. I think this might be it. Start putting some stickers on. See, why does Brandy Melville make 
it's so hard when all things Lily M makes them so easy. It's so pretty. This last one on? I think so. I get this from CW Sticker Enterprise. This is a very nice sticker. But I need to use it sometimes, so. Oh shoot, it's a little too on the edge. Here's what we have. This might be a little too on the edge, but I love it. I literally love this so much. Okay, now we got a ton of sticker backings. Let's soak this up for a second. Let us just enjoy this beauty. Okay, let's dive into this journal. So I'm not going to be fully starting entries yet, but I do want to set it up. So it says like the name and address, so I'll put in my name. I do show my journals on YouTube, so I don't think I'm going to put in an address, at least yet. So I have these like glitter pens from Dollar Tree. Um, let's see, my goldish one is here too. But I'm sticking with this silver theme because I do think silver looks really good with like a turquoise color. This journal is just really gonna have a silver star theme. Actually, I might hold off on that. We're gonna use a little post it now. just go with this for now just you know an opening page i want to make sure the sparkles and stuff dry first so we'll be back in a minute okay so this is just kind of a meaningless page but i did keep the information of the journal uh just if it's useful i don't really know so now i have these colored sheets of paper from daiso and i'm gonna choose one that kind of goes with the theme here i'm going with this yellow sheet and actually, since this notebook is bigger, I can use a full page. I'm just gonna tape this down or glue this down here. And then I think I'm gonna take this tape and do a little edge. This journal opens up weird. Like, look at this first page, how it opens up. Probably should have started on this page, honestly. It looks gray. some magazines to like do some collaging maybe 
I really like the back of this one with the light bulbs, so I definitely want to cut out some of that and put it in here. Maybe on this page. And like there's cute graphics like this. I love that. Okay, I'm gonna go through and cut things out. Will this fit? Now we have a mess. Honestly, I think we're gonna leave it at that for today. Time for a final little flip through of what we did today. First, we've got the cover with all the stickers, which make me so happy. Our little inside page, plus just some information about the notebook. Then we have my welcome page to my third journal. And I put in this magazine print. And that is it. I can't wait to start using this journal. I still have to wrap up my current journal, but hopefully that will be soon and I'll be able to get to use in this one. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed and I will see you in my next one.